A Ukrainian military spokesman has said that Ukrainian forces have come under attack from regular Russian army units in East Ukraine. This comes amid an upsurge in fighting in the region in recent days, especially around the Donetsk International Airport. In spite of all preliminary agreements, Ukrainian military units were attacked in the north of the anti-terrorist operation zone by regular military formations of the armed forces of the Russian Federation. Heavy fighting is continuing near the Ukrainian army checkpoints 29 and 31 on the so-called Bakhumska highway. Anti-terrorist operation forces have stopped the advance of Russian troops. Ukraine has long said that Russian troops are on Ukrainian territory supporting insurgents in the east. The Kremlin has been hit by sanctions from the US and the EU for its destabilization of Ukraine, though continues to deny any involvement in the conflict. A peace deal signed in Minsk last September included a ceasefire, which has proven largely ineffective, with both sides accusing each other of violations. Ukraine says it is holding up its end of the bargain. As to the fighting in Donetsk, Ukrainian servicemen do not walk and fight on the streets of Donetsk. They remain at that military separation line, namely in the territory of the Donetsk airport, as it is defined by the Minsk Memorandum from September 19th. Ukrainian servicemen do not violate these agreements. The Senko's announcement on Tuesday was one of the boldest assertions yet by Ukraine of direct Russian military involvement in the nine-month conflict. It came as the members of the OSCE, which has a monitoring mission in East Ukraine, adopted a declaration calling for an immediate ceasefire and the full implementation of the Minsk agreements.